Kovaleski. My English is not very good, like you. <laughs> I hope that you understand me what I talk and speak to you. In this time when this war is beginning, I have 16 years old. I am born first in Warsaw. I go to the school in Warsaw and after in 37, 38, 39, I stay in the school in Switzerland. Together meet uh, American people, with French people, with Belgian people. And I come back before, one month before, war is beginning. War is beginning the 1st September 39. My family, my mother and my father go to the army. Sit down, please. When my father and my mother go to the army, I think I go too. I go voluntary to the army with general and I arrived till the Russian border in 17 September 39 our troops stay in one side the Russian in one side the German we fighting with the Germans and with the Russian and in end of the September 39, general say, you young people go home. We go to the Brest, and Brest was occupied by the Russian. Russian secret service, Russian, take me to the prison. And 11 November 39, he takes all troops in the wagons to Siberia. I escaped, I arrived to Warsaw, in my home, nobody stay, only the servants stay and say to me, Mr. George, the, your parents is not here, only the friend of your parents, Colonel, stayed here. He arrived, he's not home, he arrived late. And the he arrived and said to me, George, you go to Underground's army. Yes, uh, all right, I go. And 3rd December 39, arrived my mother. And my mother no, never know that I stay in Underground's army. And I stayed in the army till 21 April 41. 20 and April 49, 41, arrived Gestapo to my home. And before the Gestapo arrived, my mother say, I stay in the underground army. And the Gestapo take me. I don't know. And you know that I stay in My mother, look, you stay in underground army? I say, yes. And maybe not take you, take me. And the Gestapo arrived. After two hours, the Gestapo stayed home, take me in the prison. Take me to the cars. With the cars, I go to the prison, the Warsaw prison. After two days, he take me to the headquarters for the interrogation. And my leg, my finger, my dance, dance is out. He tortured me from 8 o'clock in the morning till 4 o'clock afternoon. And I'm sorry that it is when I speak to you, everything's come back, you know, in my eyes. And he take me to the prison 
After two days, the same thing, interrogation. After the second interrogation, I cannot move myself. My friend take me to the cars. In the cars, I go to the prison, the hospital. It's like, you know, the wagon, like animals. You, in one wagon, 17 people, you know, 17 people go. You know, it's 350 kilometers from Warsaw till Auschwitz. Two days, no eating, no drinking, nothing. Two days, we arrive in the trucks, we arrive to Auschwitz. And when you, when you stay in Auschwitz, you know, when you arrive by train, it stops, the train stops, open the doors, every go out, the SS arriving at the capo and we go to the entrance to the camps. He is writing Arbeit nach Frei. A Rudolf Hess, commandant of the camp, say Arbeit as is work make free is not for you. For you is free cre crematorium. You go to crematorium after three months. For what reason? That you have not forced to work. You have only, you, it's possible to do work only three months. After three months, you go to the crematorium. And when you entrance to the entrance to the camps, when we arrived, street was blue. Plenty of the blood. Why? From block 11, make the transportation, these people can shooting, make the transportation to crematorium. And the prison, not cleaning, you know, the street, for that reason was the blood in the street. We arrive, is finished my name, her name is finished. I receive number a triangle, red triangle, that's political prison. I maybe somebody uh, know, you know that I receive uniforms and the triangle I show you. Yeah. That's uniform, triangle is here, and number here, and the legs. Number and triangle. And first letter is P is Polish. Russian have R, French have F. First, first letter of the nation. And we learning what we learning? First thing, the German. When somebody know German, that's very good. When somebody know, is learning the German. For what reason? For example, when you like work, and you like going to, to a, only in Auschwitz on the number. Only in Auschwitz. For that reason, Rudolf has say, to many people scared. For that reason, he make tattoo in the left hand. And is, you know, the work that's about 26 nations. And it's one thing very important for you. In our camps, in every camps in the in the Germany, or in Poland, or in French, we are the one big family is not different, ni religion, ni nation. These people, his old prison, must help. And if he help us where they stay, or as the French people, or that the Polish people, or that's the Russian people, you must help. It's obligatory for you, helping. 